In this video, I will demonstrate how you can debug remote websites with PHP ED. This is probably the most amazing feature that we provide, so please forgive me if I get a little bit too excited during this presentation. Invoices Etc. is a website served by Apache Web Server, which happens to be running on iMac G4 Apple computer. Invoices Etc. is just one of many websites served by that server, and it resides in the directory My Stuff exactly one level below Apache's document room. I am sitting in front of my Windows PC. And the easiest way for me to start remote debugging session is by using NewSphere's debugger toolbar available for Internet Explorer. It is one of the three toolbars that we install as part of PHP ED. It has three buttons. Debug this page, which means start debugging session right now. Debug next page, which means start debugging session when the next page is served and debug next post, which means start the debugging session when the next post request is executed. I'll use next post. With that checked, I'll go and type in login and password. And when I hit this login button, PHP ED starts, it loads that remote script, starts the debugging session, and breaks execution on the first line of PHP code. I know what you're thinking now. You think it's a miracle. Yes, it is. As a matter of fact, let me do it again with more appropriate divine soundtrack. So here we go again. I hit the login button. It starts. It runs. It breaks the execution of the first line of PHP code. And I can now step through the code Step in, see other remote files, step out, do the things I normally do with local debugging, see my classes, see my variables, and everything else. But now let's go back to the reality. Of course you know that there is no miracle here. It's rather fruit of the very hard labor of one very dedicated development team. When running remote scripts with PHP debugger, you can do everything you need to do to find the problem in the script. As I mentioned, you can look at the variables, look at the classes, arrays, anything else. All of the debugger tabs are still available. You can look at the locals, globals. You can set the watches, see the values assigned to the variables. You can execute PHP calls in the immediate window. Look at your stack, set the breakpoint with one click of the button, and everything else you used to do with local debugging. You just need to remember to install the dbg module on the remote server. However, if you'd like to edit the content of the file and deploy it on the remote server, you need to use PHP ED project. In this example, the script that I'm running in the debugger is still a remote script. It resides on the Apple computer. Here is the path. As you can see, it's on the remote server. PHP ED does give you the ability to execute your local files on the remote web server, edit their content, and deploy them on the fly. You need to use PHP ED's project mappings to do that. I'm going to talk about it in the next video. I do hope to see you there. Thank you.